Hello guys, welcome to Mercedes-Benz King. As you can see today we are here with the Mercedes AMG GT63 S four-door coupe. I hope you saw my previous video where I showed you the complete exterior interior and we listened to the sound. So in this video I will also show you the exterior and interior but we will take it for a drive. It has a 4 liter V8 engine with 639 horsepower and it has 900 newton meters of torque. So I will show you the complete characteristics of this car. So let's have a look at the front of the car. It has a gorgeous matte grey exterior color and from the front you can see it has those aggressive muscular lines on the hood. This GT 63S Formatic Plus 4-door coupe is based on the platform of the CLS and the E-Class, but it is significantly larger. You can see it's very wide, it is 2 meters and it has gorgeous headlights with a V-shape and also carbon fiber integrated. Large AMG front bumpers and as I'm standing here next to the wheels, it has 21 inch rims which are 275 and in the rear 315, so very wide and thick. So from the front, we will have a look at the side of the car. So it has a beautiful Paramericana grille. And from the side, you can see this amazing V8 Biturbo Formatic Plus emblem and a gorgeous coupe line with the very thick curves at the side. And it also has a lot of carbon elements from the side mirror and the side skirts. So let's have a look at the most amazing part of this car, the rear. Very horizontal, slim tail lights. And that's also what we see from the GT family. It has an optional spoiler at the rear. And this way it is fixed. You can't fold it in or out, but it's still an option and it just matches the car amazingly. It has the AMG emblem right here. Mercedes Star and the GT 63S emblem on the other side. And just look at those massive dual exhaust tips. They are very wide and large. So from the rear, we will have a look at the front again. And I will show you what's under the bonnet of this amazing AMG beast. A gorgeous 4 liter V8 engine which produces 639 horsepower. It has 900 newton meters of torque. The standard GT63 only has 585 horsepower, so the S really is some value add. So let me close the hood and we will go for a drive. Zero to 100 kilometers an hour. Amazing. In four seconds, 4.03. Let's take the GT63S four-door coupe for a drive. I will just put the key here at the center console, at the cup holders. Let's put it on the seat belt. It has a gorgeous red seat belt. And I will just press the button for the electronics to work. And there it says AMG. 
and let's start the engine. So let's listen. Amazing. I will just put it in drive with the transmission down here. The GT63S is based on the CLS platform, which of course is based on the E-Class. But they really changed the car and it is solely produced by Mercedes AMG. So it's stiffer. And we will see today how it drives. And it sounds aggressive, so let's listen. That's amazing, 639 horsepower. So it has a pretty stiff suspension, which makes this car more sportive. And the AMG Sport Cup seats are also pretty, pretty stiff in your back. So first we will have a look at the comfort mode just to see if this really changed compared to Mercedes AMG cars. So as we are in the comfort mode and we are driving around 50 kilometers an hour, it does feel comfortable just like a real Mercedes Benz. But because the air suspension has completely changed, it's also a little bit stiffer. The steering wheel is pretty light. also has an amazing sound in the comfort mode. It really pulls, it has 900 newton meters of torque. It has a gorgeous interior with red stitching, a lot of carbon elements and a gorgeous ambient lighting in the interior. Let's listen. It pulls like crazy. It has a gorgeous center console with a V-shape for the GT family. And it also has some touch buttons down here. If you touch it with your finger and go over it, it will select the possibilities. And if you want to press, for example, the vehicle settings, you just confirm by pressing on the bottom. Let's go to the dynamic select. I will show you the dynamic information right here. So this shows you the kilowatts, which is converted from horsepower and newton meters of torque. So let's put it in a different mode. It has six different modes. This is the sport mode. Then the suspension lowers a little. It becomes a little bit stiffer. And the steering wheel is also sharper. Here at the center console you can change a lot more. Also the characteristics of the car. So the transmission, the suspension, I will just press the suspension button. And now it's set to Sport Plus, which is very stiff. And I will just hit the engine button so that the exhaust valves open. And now let's listen. Amazing sound. It also has the track pace. This is actually only for on the track. So it gives a warning. And you can select your drag race option and then acceleration.
So I will decrease the speed to, let's say, 50. I will put it to Sport Plus mode. And you can also hear that the RPMs go up. So now it's in Sport Plus and let's accelerate. So 0 to 50 kilometers an hour in just 1.9 seconds. This is a better road. Let's try the 0 to 100 kilometers an hour in the race mode. is just a monster it's even more aggressive than the e63s significantly Let's enter the highway. It's so fast guys. Sport Plus. As we are driving more than 100 kilometers an hour, the rear tires actually steer with the front tire, so if I go to the right or the left, it's way easier and more efficient. The comfort level is great, so it's still a real Mercedes-Benz. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, thanks for watching Merch Benz King and I will see you guys next time. And just for the last, let's listen to the sound again. <laughs>